Keys of the Game with Campbell, 3 2 1. Please be joined now by Associate Cal. Our Associate Captain. That, that Do something. Forget you. Yeah. <laughs> were, were you an alternate captain back in the day? <laughs> zone. Rapuzzi is there. Rapuzzi looking out to the blue line to Gensel. Deep in the slot. Nate Prosser a shot that's blocked. Second attempt knocked aside by Oltice. Wiles got the first block. Oltice got the second. Now Gensel top of the right circle. Shot and a score. A tip in by Rapuzzi. Out to the side of Oltice on the stick side and Colorado College draws first blood with a power play goal with 12.25 left to go in the first period. And it's the Anchorage native, William Rapuzzi, who finds the back of the net. Seven thirty-five, the time of the power play goal as the puck came out to the point. Shot on the way and tipped out in front by Rapuzzi. Crowded on the left wing boards, double team. The puck goes deeper. Tim Hall is there looking for Tessweet. Let it go through. Prosser. Over to Gensel, back door, there's Tessweet, and there's a goal. Tick, tack, and toe. Into the net, another power play goal, and Colorado College leads it two to nothing. The goal comes at 8.55 of period number one. That was a beauty. Test weed cashing in. Prosser to Gensel. One time and in. High stepping into the CCN. Drop pass. Quick shot by McMillan. And Old Tice has it. He was looking both ways. That head snap back both ways. The puck was underneath his leg pad. Colorado College so quick getting into the offensive zone. Then they waste very little time in mounting their attack as they got that shot up. Hall came in on the left wing side, top of the left circle in a drop pass, and as McMillan was getting checked, he got off that shot that stayed low, and Johnny O got it in the lake. Face off a of formality. Clarky tries to get off a shot, and then uh, shot it just after the buzzer, and that's going to uh, ruffle some feathers, and certainly there's going to be some players uh, roughing it up there as Haddad gets into it as he's pawing away along with Addison DeBoer. Clark tried to get the shot off on the faceoff, which is about all the time he had to do with .4 seconds left to go in the uh, period. But then when that shot got blocked, Clark took another shot, and that was at or maybe a fraction of a second after the horn. And as you might guess, the Colorado College to, uh, Tigers took exception to that. And we had some pushing and shoving uh, right at the end of the first act. 20 seconds to go in a Seawolf man advantage. 18-16 to go second period. Two to nothing CC. Spencer drops a puck into the right wing corner in the CCN. Naslin for UAA. Intercepted by Gensel who anticipated nicely. Now McMillan to the left wing. Baldwin went down. Here's Sweat. Shoots and scores. Baldwin stumbled as the puck came toward him. And that gave Bill Sweat enough room to just turn on the Jets, and then he was gone. He rifled the puck past Old Tice into the net. That's a shorthanded Colorado College goal to make it three to nothing. 158, the time of the tally by Bill Sweat. And again, that's a shorthanded goal out of their own end. As McMillan sent the pass ahead. And Sweat picked low to the stick side, rifling the puck in.
54 seconds left to go in the penalty time to Schwartz. Trevor Hunt winds and fires the puck in. Off the backboards, and Joe Howe steers it around the boards. To the right wing side, right point, LaFranchise, and busting loose. Here's a breakaway for Mike Testweed. In on Old Tice. Forehand shot, score! He snapped it up and over the stick side of Old Tice into the net. And that's another shorthanded goal for Colorado College. The Tigers lead it 5 to nothing. Mike Testweed. Wow. What a laser shot that was. All the goals coming tonight in special teams play as LaFranchise had it poked loose and then Testweed was off to the races. He came in, crossed the blue line, Boltice retreating, Testweed with a quick deke, and then a shot up high on the stick side. Five to nothing CC, a long skittering left wing pass, misses Wiles. Icing his wave, and the puck slapped around the boards. Naslin toward the net, Wiles shoots and scores! That gets rid of the big zero on the scoreboard as Sean Wiles cashes in for the Seawolves. For Wiles, the junior from Beloit, Wisconsin, it's his ninth goal of the season, and it comes at a great time. Naslin along the left wing boards. Got it ahead. It was tipped by, I believe that was a Spencer. And Wilds got it. So Spencer will pick up an assist. And uh, so will uh, Naslin. Lineweber up the right wing. Slapped away at the CC blue line by Gensel. But Parkinson keeps it going. Lineweber a shot. Save made by Howe. A collision. And we've got a penalty coming up now. As one of the Seawolves clipped Howe as he went by, and Prosser takes exception to that. That was Jade Portwood, and someone's going to the penalty box here. And they'll do so after the break. 14-47 left to go third period. 5-1 to one CC. Tonight's game comes your way from the Sullivan. Center ice. Johnson trying to hit Billy Sweat in stride. This isn't easy to do. Sweat speed. you got to have that puck out there in front of you. Now Lowry, top of the left circle, a shot deflected, and there's Rapuzzi for his hat trick. Into the net it goes, and William Rapuzzi for Colorado College cashes in once again. I told you, that guy's got a nose for the net. Through youth hockey, it's always been that way for Rapuzzi, and now into the college ranks as well. Again, a power play goal. Lowry getting off the shot. Off a skate it goes. And right onto the stick of Rapuzzi. I'll tell you what, talk about being in the right place at the right time. William Rapuzzi certainly was. That is it. Time expires with Winkler and the puck back behind the net. And that is the end of tonight's contest. The Colorado College Tigers come into the Sullivan Arena and they send this crowd home in a very quiet way. Six to one, Colorado College winning tonight and they also ended up winning the shots on goal as well with the 26. But the really important uh, numbers on the scoreboard, of course, was the final score. And that is Colorado College six and UAA one.